Hello, everybody. Thanks for having me here. And uh, thanks to the previous speakers. Excellent job, very inspiring. And I think everybody here should be putting their hands up at the end of the day saying they're going to start a startup because it's like having kids. It's the craziest thing you can do, but it's also probably the most fun. So I'm just going to walk you through the back end here, of, or the, the website. So when you go to the website, this is what you see. Uh, this is, hopefully this is going to play. There we go. Is that showing up? All right, so um, we started the business. These are the co-founders, three co-founders here of food.ca, Riti, Jason, and Ben. Uh, I came back from a trip to New Zealand where I discovered this business model. I'd never heard of it before, and I thought it would be awesome because dinner in my house sucked, and it sucked hard, and I thought it could be way better. And so I just talked to Riti, and Riti, who's a sales guy at Cisco, said, you know what, I think this would work. And then we talked to Ben, who was Reedy's friend, and Ben said, yeah, I can make it work. And so he helped us um, set up the website. And what the wonderful thing about working in Vancouver is there are, it was actually amazingly easy because we, one of our back-end partners who you'll see here um, is Lemon Stand. And Lemon Stand uh, was, it was very proactive in helping us set up the site. And there are so many partners like Hootsuite and Rootific. This, we're going to go into the back end here. Sorry, I'll just segue here. So once you're a customer, you go in and you can choose if you want to change your plan. You can change how many people and how many meals you get. And we are a social company by nature. So instead of having a big culinary team, we source as much as we can from Instagram, local chefs, and we, so people who are doing amazing things. Um, Biota is a partner. They do local sauerkraut, mustard, kombucha, and they submit recipes. So we have, uh, we, today we're chatting with Edible Canada, and th this is Rutific. It helps us do all the planning. It's super easy. Uh, Vancouver Aquarium is going to start sending us recipes because they're an OceanWise partner. Um, and that's what we try to do. We source as much as we can from local purveyors. Here's Lemon Stand. This is their website. You guys should check them out. They're super rad. Um, and then this will take you through a bunch of confidential information here. Don't take any pictures. Um, it, it allows us to you know, control or, or have a look at who our customers are, uh, track our sales. Sales have been going up, which is wh what we want. We've only been delivering for about four, four and a half months, and we are steadily growing. Um, and it's a wonderful business to be part of. We created a, that's going up, that's, that's what you want to see when you start a business. That's, uh, what else am I missing here? There's a, we created a coupon code for everybody here, Tech Vancouver, 50% off your first order. Give it a shot. Let us know what, what's great. Um, well, I don't know what else we can talk about here. That's kind of it. What's your favorite meal? <laughs> My favorite. Don't say butter chicken because I'll kill you. I hate butter, butter chicken. chicken. It's not Indian food. So if you guys say you like Indian food and you like butter chicken, I'm just like disgusted in you. I really am. Sorry, Thomas. That's just my little bit. I had to do it. <laughs> um, this is actually one of my favorite meals. We use Romanesco. Has anyone had Romanesco? Anyone tried it? It's a crazy hybrid of cauliflower and broccoli, and it's phenomenal. Um, we, and then Johnston's Pork is a local pork provider, and I didn't eat pork until I started this business. And it's, uh, I got to test it, so. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's all, it's all sustainable, it's all sustainably raised. Oh, it's not, yeah, there's no, no such thing as kosher. Uh, New Ventures BC, Ian Jackson, give him a call, EUBC, Spring U. Uh, these are all great, great support networks if you're starting a business. These are some of our partners that we work with. Uh, Vancouver's Farmer's Market, we're there this weekend. If you're there, come on by. We're going to be slinging some recipes and chatting you up. And our goal is making life taste better. Um, you guys are raising, right? Yes. How much are you raising? We're, we're doing a raise of 250 So if anyone knows anyone, uh, introduce them to Thomas, not Tom. Uh, any questions? Curious questions? Yes. Vlad. Thank you. I love you. Uh, do you find you get a lot of repeat customers? Are your customers more of uh, one-time um, users? For example, if I have a group of friends, I like to order five meals from you, or do I order five meals for every day of the week? So we... we emphasize the fact that there's no commitment. So you can order once, you can come back whenever you want, whenever you have guests, whenever you have a date night. Um, our churn rate's probably 15 to 20%, so it's good in, in the States, it's about 45%, but we really emphasize the quality experience and we're constantly working to improve it and, I, and our customers love us. Like 
we make some mistakes. Sometimes we don't put sage in your chicken, and people give us give us a little bit of a break and know that we're we're doing our best we can. Yeah. Any other questions? There's one over there. Good. <laughs> yes. So every well, almost everything is compostable that we use because the packaging um, it, it kills us, and we don't want to be that. We don't want to have that experience. So everything is recyclable or compostable, and we're working towards uh, compostable and reusable, reusable packaging shortly. We're just testing some some options so that you can return our, your kits to us. Mm -hmm. So the delivery is a, a, a sticking point for us right now, and we don't charge, but we are launching a marketplace where we can offer local beer, pies, ice cream, dessert, so it can kind of pay for the delivery and we can make a little bit more from the recipe kits. Great. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. What a great local, local company.